subscribers, but you know, we got to start, you got to start where you can get it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, thank you, CT Gaming. Check it out. What do you want to know about the scar? Bench pack. I need, I need a freaking lift. Forget a bench pack. So this right here, it's got 600 horsepower, but the heads are actually stuck. So I can't build it up anymore until I get replace the heads. You know what I mean? So it could do 800, but uh, the turbos are set to 17 PSI. I can boost it up to 25, but I'm just going to enjoy it for now. And then um, get some heads. That's what you said, right? Get uh, the head done or get a new, new heads and then go from there. So, yeah, it's, it's normal. It's not that. It's just we, we, we get to swiping a lot. You know what I mean? Um, all of us are, and I'm talking about Orchata, your comment. All of us are, are, are made nowadays from swiping and swiping and swiping, not sitting here. And talking about some things. Cause we could talk about your car all day. And I can give you tips about what I think might be wrong. Why do I, what I think might not be wrong. For example. For example. You need to check that the coil. The ignition coil relay. Is working. Because this ignition coil relay. Is part of the timing. And if the timing is not good. The car is not going to crank. So. I can sit here and talk all day about that, but you're going to have to grab my attention for me to know what you need. But you wouldn't get that information anywhere else unless you sit and talk about it. So, but we're too easy to swipe real quick. So, that's what I think. I got to put these gloves on, so I'm going to put this down for a minute. And it's because social media has, has done us a, a favor of we're not um, we're not sitting in places long enough. I don't have enough money for that right now. I don't have money to buy tripods, bro. Working on these cars and working on the on the yard and working on other stuff. No money. The AC broke on this charger, so I had to get the tuner to to uh, get the ECU to uh, set up. And then I found out that the there is an actual uh, actuator that goes here that was bad. So the actuator, yeah, I know. Any any little thing? Uh, no, this is a 300 ZX. Um, Sposa Orb 300 ZX twin turbo. That one is a 86 300 ZX. And then, of course, I got my A3 back there. Um, yeah, not only that, it's just, it, it's stupid. So here's the actuator. So the arm right here moves to give me cold air or hot air. The damn thing was messed up. So the inside of this, here's the, I, I actually opened it up to show you. But look at the bottom. See those little connection? They go in there, connects in there, and they're not working. So anyways, I had another one in there, but it was an old one. So, you know, the normal, normal crap. So I ordered one. It's coming in pretty soon. No, we're going to go from there. I also ordered the fender liner for that, and this thing is going to paint this week. So welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. Thank you for joining us today. We're talking about my garage and the cars in the garage and then life itself. So out here working on my A3, but decided to show y'all the Nissan. So Twin turbo, 600 horsepower.